Hi everybody and welcome back to my channel. My name is Be Messy and I am a licensed esthetician as well as a published author of a young adult novel named Red Siren. I thought today that I would go ahead and sit down and since I am a licensed esthetician I thought that I would go through a couple of skin tools that I do get a lot of questions about when I am in services but with what is going on right now not a lot of people feel comfortable going back to the spa. With that being said, you still need to take care of your skin. I've had a couple clients contact me and say my skin is acting up and what can I do at home to get a service similar to what you would do. So these are kind of just things I would recommend for at home care even if you were getting like monthly facials or monthly sessions. and. I'll kind of go into all the specs with all of this. So go ahead, get a cup of tea. I know I have mine. But before we go ahead and jump into it, make sure to hit that subscribe button and like this video. It does help us YouTube creators a lot to get our, our content out there. And so I'll go ahead and begin with what you would do um, facial wise, I guess. So the first thing that you're gonna do is cleanse your face. And a lot of my clients ask me about the Clarisonic or a spinning brush. I'm not a big fan of those because the bristles are just a little bit too irritating on the skin. And number two, um, if you have acne, all that, if, if like one of your pustules breaks open, all that is going right into the brush and you might not know. And so all of that bacteria is getting all over your face. So why are you, it kind of takes away the cleansing of the cleansing portion. So I'm not a big fan of that. They don't sanitize very, very easily. So if you do get, you know, a pustule broken on the, the thing, how many of you are actually properly sanitizing that in a sanitation solution? Not very many, and I don't blame you for that. And But that becomes an issue because when you go to clean your face the next day, you're just gonna make the issue worse, if you guys get what I'm saying. So, I have found this little tool, and I love this thing. This is a Foreo. It's a like a vibrating device if you guys can see it has little like silicone bristles and then on the back of this one it has kind of thicker bristles on the back so Foreo actually has a wide range of products especially with these devices I think the pink one is the normal skin so on the front it's kind of for more sensitized skin the more narrow the bristles and then on the back since it's a little bit more rough it's for the like the really thick skin they do have different colors and each color is like a different skin type. So I have the normal skin one. Again, I described the difference between the two bristles. They do have a lavender one that my sister-in-law has. She really enjoys it. She uses it about twice a week, which is what I would recommend. And that's for more sensitized skin. I know that they have, I think, an orange one for more acne prone skin. Um, so it's going to be a little bit more different with each version. They also have like mini versions. They have a ton. So do your research. I did not want, and I don't recommend to clients, they have one that's a bit cheaper than this one. No. I think this one was cheaper than the, I don't know actually. Um, I can't remember. But they have one that like has an app with it. So you wash your face or something and then you go on the app and it tells you your skin age. I don't know about you, but I don't want to know that. <laughs> I know that I'm 24 years old and I have good skin, but I still don't want to know that. I also don't know how they get that. I don't. I, I just don't know how they they get that information. So I'm not. I'm not a big fan of that one. I just go with the regular one that doesn't have Bluetooth. So with this, I recommend twice a week, especially with like a glycolic cleanser. It's amazing. So. If you like a good microderm, 
this is going to give you a very similar experience. It's going to exfoliate your skin in a gentle manner, yet when you like rinse your face and you feel your skin, I was amazed the very first time I used this. I am not getting paid by the company to say that, but I was I was like, oh my gosh. You can kind of get addicted to that feeling, and so I started using it every single day, and that was just too much. It, it You really don't need to use it that often, but twice a week, I like get really excited when I'm going to use this, but... I just highly recommend it for anybody who is with dry skin, normal skin, oily skin. Also, the silicone, this device is waterproof. It's silicone, so it's more hygienic than a brush. And it's really easy to clean. All I do is I rinse it under some warm water, and then I put a little bit of alcohol on it. It doesn't, this is medical grade silicone, so it doesn't harbor bacteria. It doesn't let anything grow on it, which is amazing. So highly, highly recommend this one. And yeah, the next cleansing tool is a little bit, I not a lot of people sell this, I do. And it's called the My Skin Buddy. And it looks like this, and you guys can see your reflection. But also on the back, it has like a magnifying glass. I don't ever use that. I don't know why that's there, but okay. So this little device is amazing as well. So if I'm not using the Foreo, I will be using this. It has negative and positive ions. It has ultrasound. It's divine. I remember when I used this the first time, even like to this day, after I use this, my skin feels tighter and it looks tighter. It's like, like a temporary Botox. It's amazing. So let me go ahead and pull up the specs. So my skin buddy is a revolutionary device. There is nothing like it on the market. It is has LED in it. It has four proven technologies to help you achieve cleaner and tighter skin and youthful looking skin. It's amazing. I bought this a couple years ago. I actually met the CEO founder and creator of the skin buddy and we had a chat she is the most lovely woman she has happiness guaranteed so a lifetime warranty on her devices i've had this three years and i adore it so this device has a couple different things so it has a cleansing mode which is if you just click this button <laughs> she heard that um, it's vibrating right now, and if you can see, it has some red LED in there. So, I'll actually go through all the colors. It has all, all of them. No, how do I turn it off? <laughs> you hold it. So, the first mode is the cleansing mode. You just have to click it once. It's automatic. And what this will do is it has red LED, which is clinically proven, I think scientifically proven as well, to be... Um, collagen stimulating and anti-aging you also i've also had a good success with inflammation going down and acne so this little tip right here this little like metal tip it's going to heat up a little bit so it's going to be warm on the face it's not going to be hot but it's going to be very very warm on the face and it's going to be so relaxing so that heat number one helps pores relax. A pore does not open and close like a door, but it does help the pores relax. So that product um, can, number one, get into the pore and clean it out. And then all the stuff can kind of get wiggled off of the pore and come out, if that makes sense. You will break out after using this. I give you fair warning. I give it like a couple weeks and you can use this every day. But I, I don't have acne anymore. I don't have any, I mean, this is so good. You just have to try it. So the first one is red LED and it also has positive ions to help bring out all of the gunk that is in your pores. It also has a little bit of like a vibration to it. Another reason I like this is because instead of having bristles, it has a clear like titanium disc which is super, super sanitary. All you have to do is just rinse it with a little bit of 
rubbing alcohol on a cotton pad. And that's it. It's super, super sanitary. Highly recommend it. Okay, so let's go ahead and get into the other modes. So we have the red, then we have the blue. The blue is said to be good for acne, but blue LED actually is not a long wavelength. And when I say that, different LEDs have different wavelengths. So red LED gets really down in there, um, especially if you have a high voltage. With LED, you do have to have a certain amount of voltage um, and it's not going to be effective under 660 nanometers, I think it's called, or nanowatts. I think it's nanometers. It's not going to be effective. On like Neutrogena, the LED stuff, and things that you can buy on Amazon, go ahead and look and see if they say how strong their LED is. You probably won't be able to find anything. But my skin buddy does. So, it blue LED only goes like down to like the surface acne. So it's gonna clear you up, but if you have anything down here, instead of like, this is like the top skin, this is where the acne is, and like this is like where like really a lot of oil is, um, it's not gonna kill it. It's gonna kill this, take that away, but then you're gonna have that issue, and that's gonna be a worse issue. So that's why I like green for acne. So green, <laughs> So green is just good for everything. It's good for um, inflammatory, it's good for redness, it's good for um, rosacea clients, it's good for acne. It's going to calm down any acne. It's also going to just kind of kill that bacteria. It's good for even anti-aging. It's just one and done. So I, I like a red and a green. I'm not a big fan of blue. After that, it does have a cycle mode which is going to give you all of the colors um, all at once. So like you would just be doing this and it would just be rotating through the colors. This will last um, 10 minutes. So it's a 10 minute session. You do want to do the full 10 minutes because LED has to have at least 10 to 20 minutes for it to be effective. So don't do it for 30 seconds and just think that you get all the benefits. Unfortunately, you do have to like it's kind of like tanning. Like if you want to get a tan, you have to sit there for a little bit. If you want the benefits of LED, you do have to let it run for the full 10 minutes. But it's one of my favorite devices and I highly, highly recommend it. All right, so I have those two down and now I'm going to show you this. And this is called the Eye Rejuvenator. So This is made for the eye area. It kind of looks like that. It has a little power button. So what this is, is this is microcurrent. And microcurrent is a technology that I really love. I love it because it's basically re-educating the muscles in your face to be youthful and kind of like up. So it's basically like, exercise for your face and it's actually a technology that I use in the tre treatment room a lot so with this device it has a metal tip that warms up to about your body temperature and I like to just use it around the eye area with an eye gel with microcurrent you can't use a thick eye cream because you won't get the current the current needs like water to be conductive so that's a good like eye gel so I just go ahead and it will beep after one minute and then you switch to the other eye and it will beep when it's finished. You can also use this around the lips to make them look a little bit more plump on the smile lines and everything like that. This is a proven technology. I use it in treatment all the time. I actually give people like eyebrow lifts. So what you could do is like kind of lift your brow with this like in three different places. It's an amazing, amazing tool and it's it's so yummy feeling. It's just, you just put it on and you're just like, oh, it's so relaxing. It helps with dark circles, puffiness. It's just my favorite device and you will not find many people selling this, um, but I do at my treatment room. So something like this is amazing <laughs> and I really, really like it. Let's talk about a professional technology and a professional skincare tool. Um, that is sold to the public. So I in the treatment room use a sonic 
scrubber, a sonic spatula, which looks like this. And a lot of you probably know what this is. Let's talk about it. So the sonic scrubber really helps with cleansing and exfoliating. It will kind of like have this weird noise and I'm not going to turn it on because it's really, this one is really high pitched. They're not supposed to be high pitched. They're supposed to be low pitched. And Alice will go crazy. I used this last night and Alice like jumped up because um, it's that high of a wavelength that dogs can hear it. So you can use this to take off your cleanser and to do extractions with. That's what we do in the salon, in the spas. But I'm going to tell you guys not to buy this. And I'm going to tell you why. So number one, if you purchase this, it's very, 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 very difficult to use on yourself. And you're not going to get the benefits because it's just so difficult to use on yourself. And I have seen so many of these companies. This is from Vanity Planet. Um, I've seen so many of these companies on Instagram selling these. And the comments will be from clients who literally say in the comment, I have no idea what this is, but I bought it. And I have no idea how to use it, but I bought it. And I want to tell you guys not to just buy random things on Instagram. I'm sorry, don't waste your money. And as a professional who has used a professional device, I wanted to purchase this just to see if I could recommend it to you guys. And I can't because it doesn't, it's not... It says it had 30,000 vibrations and all of that, but I don't believe that it does. The reason why is because it sounds so different than the device that I have in treatment. And it just doesn't, I don't know if it's just because I'm using it on myself, but I did use it on a client yesterday and I could not get out any of his blackheads with this. I don't think it's strong enough. I don't think it's made well enough. I think companies just like to jump on a trend and give it to people so you can definitely like you know put like a little thing and put all the things in it i can't test how many vibrations are in it i can't test how strong it is and companies know that sometimes they can just put numbers up and know that the, that the audience is not going to know any different and this was just $100 less than the professional one that I can get, but, and it looks really nice, and I'll keep using it on myself just for at-home treatments, but I wouldn't recommend it to you guys because it's just not that effective. It doesn't have the nice spray of water, it just, especially with an electrical device, I if you don't know how to use it, you can really do damage. There's a lot of contraindications that people don't know, I just, I would not buy something like this. Actually, why I'm saying that is because this has like the ions and the negative ions that this has. This also has LED in it and it's going to do the same thing that this is going to do. So I would rather you buy this than this because they're the same price and a lot of times these companies, I mean the instructions I got was in Chinese and which is fine but I'm just saying a lot of these companies, you know, if I was to open this up and to open up my professional one, I'm sure that there would be different inside. They can't, they don't know how to make these devices because they're not professional. They are jumping on bandwagons. They are making things look identical to a professional one, make it really pretty, but the results are not there. And unfortunately, I want to tell you guys that because I want you to save your money. I don't want you guys buying things that's going to be number one kind of expensive and not going to do anything for you. And you're not going to know that until I say that or if you get a professional treatment and you're like, oh, wow, this is totally different because we have devices um, that are stronger than things that you can buy online. And honestly, this is just awkward to use on yourself and get it all the nooks and crannies. I would not recommend it for at-home use. I think that they are a great device for estheticians to use in treatment. But again, I feel like my skin's smoother when I use this than when I use this. And that shouldn't be the case. So I would go ahead and 
not buy the Sonic this skin scrubber and save your money and buy the Foreo because they're about the same price or buy the My Skin Buddy. So that is, and actually they're not the same price. Um, my price is the same. So I get this for a discount. I get this for a discount um, because I, it's, I'm a professional and I um, retail it and I also, a lot of, it's just, I get a discount because I'm an esthetician. So if this was good, I would have I, I would recommend it. But unfortunately, I can even notice the difference in the sound it makes. And even when I was using it just on my hand, I noticed there was no spray of water. It just it, it was a waste of money in my in my opinion. So go ahead and save your money. Buy the My Skin Buddy, buy the Foreo. Just don't buy a Sonic Skin skin scrubber i'll say that again and kind of if you guys have any questions go ahead and leave them in the comments below dm me on instagram um because i'll give you my honest opinion and i want you guys to be able to buy tools that are going to be effective and that you guys are going to use at home so with that being said i'll go ahead and wrap this video up i hope you enjoyed it if you did give it a big thumbs up make sure to purchase my young adult book red siren and i'll see you guys in my next one bye